Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's six box red zone football mixer. It's a random team mixer. And at the end of the break, different dice roll at the end of the break, we are giving away this autographed 16 by 20 photo, Todd Gurley. That's when his knee wasn't bothering him. Right there. His knee apparently is a big issue. All right, and here are the boxes in the break. As you saw right there, some good stuff. And a bonus giveaway. Nice. Big thanks to these folks for getting into the action. Really appreciate it. All teams are in. And let's roll the dice for each list. Six times. Names and teams. Your names first. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Got Kevin Crouch down to Jake Ledford. Four and a two, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. After six, we've got the Eagles down to the Finns. And here's how it shakes out. Kevin Crouch with the Fly, Eagles Fly. Jeff Colehaber, Last Spot Mojo, Lions. Brandon with the Steelers, Vasilis with the Titans. Briggs, you got the Packers. Colton with the Chiefs. Stephen K with the Redskins. Brandon with the Browns. Mikey got the J-E-T-S, Jets, Jets, Jets. Brandon with the Chargers. Cardinals, Bills, Vasilis with the Ravens. Brandon with the Niners. Rams, Colts, Broncos, Vasilis with the Buccaneers. Brandon with the Bengals and the Falcons. Colton with the Patriots. Jeffrey with the Cowboys. Ryan with the Seahawks. Jeff with the Giants, New York Football Giants. Stephen Z with the Texans. Brandon with the Panthers. David Bruins with my Raiders. Brandon with the Jags. Vikings. Saints. Adam with the Bears. And Ledford, you got the Dolphins. All right, let's alphabetize by team. Any trades? Here are the boxes. We're going to start off with the Elite X. Oh, remember, um, they don't have group break checklist, doesn't have a checklist, or cardboard connection. Both of those sites don't have a checklist that associate these players by their pro teams, and they're all in their college gear. So it'll go to the team that they are currently on. If they were undrafted and they're not on a current team, they're in the AAF or like the CFL or something like that, it'll go to the team they were last associated with. Uh, Jets for trade, maybe. Redskins for Saints. Bears are up for trade. And we do have another mixer on the site um, where we're giving away... Oh. Another mixer on the site where we're giving away the Omari Cooper autographed football. This uh, red zone break is where we're giving away the Todd Gurley. Where, where's that Todd Gurley? There's the Todd Gurley right here. So that's what we're giving away in this break. So separate dice roll at the end. You get that one. It's a cool picture too. Love it. All right. Looks like no trades. So we will just go ahead and go. TWC means trade window closed. Let's print that list. Make it official and let's rip. We've got Houston up 49-35 on the Raptors right now. Three minutes left in the half, first half. All right, so here's the official list, right? What's going on up there?
Doesn't look very nice. Let's try that again. Take two. All right, so there are the boxes right there. One, two, three, four, five, six. And here, it, now here's the official printout. There you go, that looks nice. Jeff with that last spot mojo lines, and there's everybody else. Brandon, yes, you did get 15 spots. I have you for 15. If I control F Brandon, it says out of 15, right up there. All right, box one. Good luck, everybody. It's all right, Brandon. It's counting. So oh, you know what? He Remember how that the, your cardinal spot got cut off on the on the screen? That was probably your fifteenth spot. What's up, Rick? Uh, yeah, g yes and no. Spots have been moving kind of steadily. It's busy now. I, I would imagine that it'll, uh, with a big new release tomorrow, it should slow down a little bit later tonight. So that's, I've been encouraging everyone to get their spots early and often before that in in inevitably happens. So get your spots early and often, ladies and gentlemen. Jaspiescasebreaks.com if you're watching live. Oh, there you go. Rick Barker's like, I'm here. It's going to pick up now. All right. I like that attitude. You know, that, that's, what, uh, that's what Bruce Springsteen said in one of his hit, hit songs. I think Dancing in the Dark, right? You can't start a fire without a spark. Rick Barker could be that spark, ladies and gentlemen. So follow his lead. Brandon, Brandon wants you to pick up some flawless baseball spots, Rick, if that interests you. All right, boys and girls, B's and G's, here we go. We got Fred Warner. Everyone remembers where Fred goes, right? He sounds like a niner to me. Yes. Got it. Brandon with the 49ers. Nice. Mark Madsen confirms. Nice. Feel pretty good about that. You know, someone else made that same comment. I did. I'm doing my best uh, Payne Stewart impression on the miniature golf course. You should see my pants. I should actually, I should actually get a pair of like Payne Stewart pants. There's Damon Webb. He sounds like a. Uh, what does he sound like? An eagle? A pirate, maybe? Not a pirate. He doesn't play baseball. He plays football. A stealer, perhaps? He is... Oh, he's a titan. All right. That goes to Vasilis with the Tennessee Titans.
we got Christian Lacouture. One out of ten. He sounds he sounds like a ja this guy sounds like a Jaguar, John Samuelson. John was guessing Jaguars for the previous guy. This one sounds like a Jaguar. No, he's he's a he's a bird. He's a raven. Not a cat. Thought he went from cat team to cat team. All right, so that goes to the Ravens. That'll also be for Vasilis. We know all these guys. Nice, the A's had a great break there, Mr. Bone. Very nice. There's Mike McCray, who sounds like a Niner. Did the Ravens cut Eric Weddle today? Interesting. Mike McCray is, is a current analyst for the Michigan Wolverines. All right, all right. Well, what did you went undrafted? Were you not associated with any pro team? Oh, he signed with the Dolphins as an undrafted free agent, but then it announced his retirement just two days before the start of training camp. What's the story behind that? It's interesting. Well, that goes to the Dolphins. That'll be for Jake Ledford. Just wondering, do all the cars ship in the college uniforms? Uh, probably not. I don't know. I'll bet these will. I bet the rookies will. And there's Andrew Brown. Everyone wears a... Yeah, that was a monster hit, Ledford. Um... <laughs> He's an announcer now. So, I mean, that he's a current analyst for the Michigan Wolverines. There you go. That's a, that's a big school. He could be in the Broadcasting Hall of Fame before you know it. Andrew Brown is a bangle. Wait, did you look it up, John, or did you know? He, he guessed bangles. <laughs> no. No, Adam, I don't think we will. Yeah, sure, John. I think there's only a couple left. But yeah. In the meantime, I can guess. <laughs> oh, I know where Terrell Edmonds goes. That's how you spell Edmonds, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, who's got the Steelers? Brandon Luger with the Steelers. All of his autographs are like that. <laughs> and that is that, ladies and gentlemen. There you go. All right. So that was 2018 Elite Draft Picks. American football. So next up, we'll go 2018 Panini Prism football. Rick Barker saying, who's saying Kyler Murray struggled today in Indianapolis during workouts? Is he actually doing workouts? I thought he wasn't doing anything until pro day. I did hear that, that Kyler Murray had struggled in interviews. That he wasn't a very he wasn't very good in interviews.
Oh, so he's doing some workouts, Kyler Murray? Oh, maybe he is doing workouts. He's just not running and he's not throwing or something like that. I don't know what he's doing. What is he doing? Uh, NFL.com apparently reporting it. Flawless baseball's already down to three? Nice. All right. 2018 Prism Football. A lot of football news happening. The Combine just wrapped up. I guess we're going to see some pro days happening. There's Taekwon Lusa, 249 die cut. And then the league calendar turns over. Then trades and free agency opens up. Then the draft will be here before you know it. Then mini camps and training camps and preseason and then football. Be crazy. There's Arden Key for my Raiders to 149. Oh, sorry about that. With my Raiders Amari Cooper hands there. We've got Corey Davis Green, cracked ice to 75. We got Devonta Freeman die cut to 249. Well, it's, it's going to be a wild off season. You know, yeah, like Redskins are interested in Rosen. New York Football Giants could be interested in Rosen. There's Minka Fitzpatrick. There you go, Jake Ledford. Dolphins. It's a little bit better, <laughs> a lot better. Nice Minka Fitzpatrick. Cardinals could trade out of that one spot. They could not. They could take Kyler Murray right then and there. No, I don't think Colton. I agree. I don't think Josh Rosen is bad at all. I don't, and he certainly did not get a fair shake with that that Steve Wilkes offense, that vaunted Steve Wilkes offense last year. Um, there's Dan Bailey for the Cowboys. You know, so he's got a lot to. It's just a matter of how much is Cliff Kingsbury, Clinsbury, Kingsbury, on the Cardinals' new Matt, new coach. You know how much he wants Kyler Murray. Forty-seven nine ninety-nine. Chris Hogan. There's Dante Pettis and Derek Nadi. Blue scope for the Chiefs. That'll go to Colton Carver. Fifty-eight out of ninety-nine. Points we'll randomized to one person in the break. So here's what we'll do with those points. Uh, the name on top, we'll get that Todd Gurley photo, that big Todd Gurley photo. Second name, we'll get the 250 points. It's the consolation. There's David Johnson to 199 die cut. Dr. Mario saying that Cardinal O line was awful. It was. Kyler Murray might get killed if he joins the Cardinals. <laughs> Here's Jordan Reed to 249. And there's Prism. Uh, we usually go on air tomorrow, uh, at around 3 o'clock Pacific and usually get our first break going by the bottom of the hour, 3.30 Pacific. We usually use that first bit of time to to go through some orders and get people filtered in, filtering into the room and all that stuff. Get a little little warm up going, and then and then really hit the hit the ground running from there. All right, where should we go next? Some good, just good, hard to decide. How about plates and patches? We've got a full case of this in the store, ladies and gentlemen. If you want to pick your team and do a break of this, I am down. Trevor, Joe, I've been meaning to tell you, you work with someone who's drafted in the first round 
of the 2001 MLB Draft. Um, because he's no longer in baseball. <laughs> who, who, who is this person? Samaj P. Ryan, plate for Stephen K. and the Redskins. Stephen K. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. How far did he get, Trevor? In the world of baseball. Five out of 50, Jarvis Landry for the Browns. Brandon with the Browns. And there's James White. Nice relic there. 37 out of 55. Supreme swatches for the Patriots. Colton with the Pats. And the redemption behind Travis Kelsey is going to be... Saquon Barkley. Wow. Is that a printing plate autograph? Saquon Barkley for Jeff Goldhaber, who got randomized the New York football giants. Ooh. That is nice. So nice. He got a ring twice. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Out of a mixer. Like one box out of a case tossed into this mixer. Who knows what's going to happen in these things? Wow. All right, let's go 2018 Contenders Optic Football. We've got two inner cases loaded up in the store right now. We can do those tonight as well. What a hit. Boy, uh, Rick Barker was saying earlier before that monster hit. Gruden spoke uh, highly of Rosen and was shopping, uh, was shopping uh, Derek Carr around. Would I be okay with Josh Rosen? I'm a UCLA guy, so I, I wouldn't mind. <laughs> I've watched Josh Rosen a lot. I mean, I don't watch too much college football, as you guys know, but if I do, it's probably UCLA football. Um, so I'm okay with him. I think he he makes some great throws. So we'll, we'll collect these as one lot right here. I don't know. I, at this point, Rick, <laughs> I'd like the Raiders to build a team and then maybe kind of stick with it for a little bit. <laughs> Instead of rebuilding every few years. Out of 99, Marvin Jones Jr. And behind Joe Flacco, this should be the on card. It is. It's Carry On My Wayward Son, Rookie of the Year contenders. That goes to the Lions. Jeff Goldhaber, again, last spot mojo this time. 67 out of 99. Nice. Honors. Uh, but, Rick, this is also... This is also Everyone lies season, right? This is the time of the year where every front office lies. No one's giving anybody any any edge. There's a lot of misdirection happening here, so it's kind of hard to really, you know, to really take any rumors or whatever super seriously, you know? So everyone's trying to misdirect people, trying to get people to, trying to fool other teams, blah, 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 blah. We've got, wow, one of one from Flawless Football, Randall Cobb. Ooh. That is for Briggs and the Green Bay Packers. Briggs, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. A train whistles in this one. And the second one here. Wow. One out of seven Jets edition of LT Ladanian Tomlinson. Jersey and autograph. Wow. From 2011 Prestige Football. 
That is awesome. That goes to Mike Malvers, who got randomized the Jets in this one. Nice one, Mike. All right, and America's favorite game, Who Am I? And then we'll randomize the Todd Gurley 16 by 20 photo. And the second spot on the randomizer will get the points, both of the points. Winner take all the points. All right, and we'll play America's Favorite Game, Who Am I? College rules, non-pro uniform rules apply in this. I'm sure most of you know the rule by now. If there is a college helmet that gets pulled, it'll go to the team that the person played for the longest or the team they're currently on. If they're active, the team they're currently on. Inactive, the team they play for the longest. If it's a college coach helmet for some reason, it'll be randomized to one person in the break. It'll be, let's say it'll be uh, number two on the randomizer and the points will be three. How about that? But this is a pro team, so all that disclaimer was for nothing. Um, okay, who am I? Old school guy. Think old school. Um, let's see. Played college football at Ohio State back in the 1950s. Cornerback. When I played pro football. Two-time Super Bowl champion with a team that's not this helmet. I'll just tell you, two-time Super Bowl champion with the Steelers, but that's not the helmet that he's, he's on. Uh, known for being, this might start to give it away, known for being one of the best defensive coordinators in NFL history. I was also a national champion in 1957, by the way. Credited for inventing the zone blitz. Really? I didn't know that. Credited for inventing the zone blitz, which is still used today by a lot of NFL teams. Most NFL, if not all. Any guesses? Who am I? Do I have more? Let me, I could fire up the Wikipedia, give you guys some more. Trevor's at a loss. Let's see. He is, got drafted in 1959, round five, pick 58, from London, Ohio, went to Ohio State. Am I currently working right now? I'm not currently working right now, but my last job was as a defensive coordinator for the Titans between 2015 and 17. Three-time Pro Bowler as a player, three-time second-team All-Pro as a player, two-time Super Bowl champion as a coach, Sporting News Coordinator of the Year in 2008. 81 years old now. Hall of Fame in 2010. There you go. Jeff's got it. Boom. It's Dick LeBeau. There it is. Got, got into the Hall of Fame in 2010. There's his autograph right there on the Lions helmet. Lions have one of the, one of the best logos in football, right? I mean, it's like Raiders and then Lions, right? That's what I think, anyway. Nice, you got the TriStar Authentic sticker right there. That goes to Jeff Goldhaber. Had a pretty nice break in this one. Last spot mojo as well. Okay, um, let me actually set this aside right here. Let's put this right here. Let me see if I could show you the autograph. There you go. This is also, you got the Beckett certificate right there. All right. So everyone has a shot at this. It looks like Flawless is coming up next. Stephen K saying she gone. Nice. Okay, so let's go here. Let's get everyone from Brandon down to Stephen K and everybody in between. So name on top gets the Todd Gurley autograph photo, which is really cool, perfect for framing. And the second name will get uh, both of those points. Cards. After seven times, lucky seven on the randomizer, five and two. Good luck, everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven times, second name gets the points. 
and that'll be Jeffrey. And the name on top is Brandon. There you go, Brandon. That Todd Gurley autograph photo coming your way. There you have it, man. Oh, there's the other Beckett sticker right there. Very nice. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Another nice mixer in the books. We've got another football mixer on the site right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com, where we're giving this away. So look out for that. Giving away more memorabilia. So check it out, jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.